Technology runs out of work. But even in the most mundane of machines, what's below the surface is much more complicated than meets the eye. Welcome to Tri-City. And in a world where electricity is blood, keeping yourself lit up means keeping yourself alive. When the bright leave little for the dim, some will do anything to get their hands on it. Dead! We're dead! We're dead! I told you! We are so dead! Oh, by the way, what's your name? This is not the time for questions, idiot. You know what? I'll just call you Ella. Electricity. What the fuck? Hey, how did you do my gun? Headshot, motherfucker! Oh, that must have hurt. Shut up and just concentrate. Damn it, Eric. You almost shot me, huh? Sorry about that. This is our headquarters. Built nearly a thousand years ago. More like ten months. Full of top class equipment. And yes, filled with highly educated people like me. His brain is filled with nonsense. Shh, 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 sh shut up, boy. I'm trying to show her the dramatic entrance. Uh, no, 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 not that door. Down here. Oh, son. You guys will not believe it. She was like, here, and then she was like, there, and then, whoa, hey She doesn't even have a color. You're not a primary color yourself, you know. Show them what you got, girl. I can't even bear to look at her. At least she's not cursed to be the color of Barbie forever. <laughs> ow, 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 I didn't say anything, he did. Fine, she can join. But she'll have to go to the port. Are you crazy? That's suicide. I know. Yeah, we have no idea what's behind this. Sorry to cut in, Eric. Watching you fail has gone from entertaining to just plain sad. We don't let them tell you who you should be. Oh boy! I didn't know you were a skateboard. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I can't wait to ride you. Get yeah, no. You don't need a color to be pretty. I think you're beautiful just the way you are. Grab my hand. Trust me. Oh, oh, okay. That doesn't work. Electricity was a short animation um, talking about this little girl who wakes up and finds out she has superpowers, that she can charge phones because she is actually electricity. Um, but then people start chasing her and wanting to use her. She kind of goes mad and starts to defend herself. But later on she realizes that she is not doing the right thing. She is hurting people when she sees this little girl. So she became confused and ran away. That was the story of the first Electricity. I really liked how it turned out though, so I decided to make a sequel to this. And I wanted it to be a series. I wanted more characters to interact with her. Um, she's got this double personality. She's normally very shy, but when she gets mad, she shows her real self and she, she unleashes all her abilities. Tri-City had to be something about electric, like it had to be a city that somehow needed her power. So I thought, how about a phone? Everyone charges their phone every day, and what that does is help show the colors on our screen so we can see what we're doing. With this in mind, I decided to make um, the other characters basically the colors that are in your phone. So you got like red, blue, green. Those are the primary colors that make up light. In this city, if you have a brighter color, which is like closer to the primary colors, then you're treated better. And if you don't have colors at all, usually you're not treated that well because people want the bright colors to light up. They don't really care about the darker colors. In light, if you mix red, green, and blue, 
what you get is white light, which is also the same color as electricity. Electricity produces white light. So I thought I wanted this character to be someone shy, someone innocent. People look down upon her, but deep inside she's actually this hero. She's she's underestimated. So this is when we introduce our next character, which is Eric. Um, I wanted him to be, you know, full of energy and that guy that will act before he thinks. I mean, that's how all cartoons do it. That's how they get in trouble. And of course, um, he always does it for good. Like, he wishes to help out. He just always causes trouble in the end. So that's why his companion robot, which name is Boy, is more of a calm type. Um, he's this parent-like friend that would usually give more helpful advice to Eric. And of course, usually won't joke around like Eric would. Anyway, Eric finds this factory, goes inside to investigate, and he finds this girl, which is Ella. So they start to escape. When the guards come in and chase them, Ella shows her powers. After seeing that, Eric is stunned. He's like, okay, I gotta bring this girl back. I mean, this could change the fate of our city. Um, there's something behind there, and this girl seems like she's got potential to help investigate deeper into this problem. So he brings her back and shows her to the team. Now, the team, um, I've actually created some characters, but the main ones is Pinky, which is the team leader. And now she's this rich, pretty girl. Well, at least she thinks she's pretty. So she's she's got this really bitchy attitude, like everything she says, she thinks is right. And then the other boy's name is Rad which is that one guy that does everything better than the main character and makes the main character very jealous. So Eric and Rad are kind of like friends, but rivals at the same time. Uh, no, I'm not freaking jealous. I'm t totally fine. The whole series is based around Ella, binding with these friends that she meets. She is a total stranger in this town and she lost her memory, she can't talk. And she helps these friends find out what's going on in their city because they don't actually know they are living inside a phone. And they don't know why there's limited electricity that is being put into the phone every day. They also don't know why there's not enough electricity for everyone. That is not right. Everyone should be having electricity, yet only the brighter colors are getting the power. Electricity is like their food and money. So they depend on it, they need that to survive and to light up. Although this is going to be a full series, the trailer that I'm going to present is only a small introduction to the city and the characters. So I hope you got to know a bit more watching this video. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy. It's running.